Peter Ducey, Karine Jean-Pierre, the press secretary, the only press secretary. I want to be the press secretary to the president of the United States. Anybody that knows me knows this to be true. Let's hear this little exchange, if you don't mind. Are counted two different things. Somebody unvaccinated comes over on a plane. You say that's not okay. Somebody walks into Texas or Arizona unvaccinated. They're allowed to stay. But, Why? But that's not how it works. Yeah. Like we that's actually no. I know that that's not what you guys want to happen, but that is what ha- what is happening. But that's not. It's not like somebody walks over and <laughs> that's not. That's, that's not exactly how. Exactly what's happening. We well, thousands of people are walking in a day. Some of them turn themselves over. Some of them are caught. Tens of thousands a week are not. That is what is happening. Now I'm about you, but I want more pressure like that. I want more exposure like that. The queen of the border, Camilla Harris, hasn't even been to the border. I don't blame this lady. See, people always blame press secretaries, right? What a bad position. And I always wanted to be in a bad, I always wanted her job. It's the only dream job I've ever had. People say, well, coaching Indiana, dream job. Yeah, maybe, I guess, in sports. But my ultimate dream job is press secretary to the president of the United States. You get to see how everything is run. You get to see how everything is spun. You get to get up there. There's a lady named Helen Thomas. I always wanted to tell Helen Thomas, hey, Helen, sit down. Peter Ducey does a great job, and I wish there was more of it. I don't understand how there's not more of it. How can you look yourself in the eye as a person that went to journalism school at Syracuse? I came through Newhouse. I came through the media school at Indiana. Cuban media school. Medill. I think it's Medill. At Northwestern. You know, at Missouri, we have a great media school. No, you don't. None of you do. Because none of you have the stones to do what Peter Ducey just did which is ask some, well, I don't know. How do you call, she's dating this woman as a CNN correspondent. So I don't know. Is she being partial? Of course not. Is she literally in bed with the media? Of course. At least that's what I'm being told. I'm not there. I mean, who is? Not me. But I got to tell you, Peter Ducey, I wish more would. I don't understand why more don't. Why don't they? Tell me, please. Why don't more people do what Peter Ducey just did? Why? Are they so in pocket? Are they? All right. Fine. By the way, today is cut day in the NFL, and this just came in. The Colts have released Philip Lindsay. That's a surprise. Anyway, I digress. Why aren't more people asking this question? Why are more media, quote, journalists asking these questions? Why so in pocket? I don't have the answer. 